All right, let's do a new world. Okay, so first things first, deforestation. Gosh dang lag, I, I can't afford a better computer because life. All right, we're just gonna chill under this decomposing tree. So we can get some sticks. Alright, ready? Big brain move. We're gonna get some sticks from the tree. We're crafting some. Because I'm freaking lazy. This is so sad. Alexa, play Despacito. I got an apple though. I can't find the song Despacito on Apple Podcasts. Alexa, I didn't ask. Thank you. Your feedback will help improve the experience. <sighs> okay. Okay, we got that. Okay, I do see some sugar cane over there. One of my brothers, he... I mean, he comes up with weird names for all sorts of crap. For a while, he called sugarcane visage. Pumpkins. <gasps> no way! It's a village! Oh, please be on mostly a flat surface. Whoa, that's a big one. And there's a cave right there. Epic sauce. That's looking to be a big one. I might even be able to skip the stone and go straight for an iron pickaxe right now. Depending on what's on these in these houses. Sad. Play Despacito, not A L E X A. Nice. Always take all that stuff, except for the. Yeah. You are the enemy of the people. Truly a threat to democracy. We're gonna have to find a way to quietly dispose of that guy. No chest, but there is a... Uh, there are some of those blocks I can use rather than having to double smelt some stone. That's always nice. It's a Fletcher boy. We love that. What are you doing there? Okay, I feel like I've haven't gone through all the houses. No, I've already gone through that. That guy needs to be destroyed. Okay, I guess that's this is a little you know, this little crevice in the ground is not all that dangerous, actually. I thought it was gonna like go down to deep slate level like Things tech caves tech generally tend to bleh, words like like caverns generally tend to do when they run through villages, but that one's pretty all right actually. It doesn't pose any harm. I will take these bookshelves though. Oh, oh, this is. I am so tempted to just let the water run in here because of, like, after playing Minecraft Classic. Because the... Ooh, another library. 
nice. Because, like, the, the, the liquid mechanics were so jank. It was just, like, it would just instantly, immediately fill, like, any open space. So if I just, like, made a trail to that, it would just, just fill that whole thing. And wow. I'm, is this even... Is this even one village, or is this just two villages that just happen to generate next to each other? No, this this is totally two villages. Holy crap. This is, like, the ideal scenario right here. All I really need... Holy crap! Look at all that obsidian! How much is in here? Nine? There's almost enough for a full portal in there! Wow! You need to be disposed of as well. There's a librarian in here too, meaning more books. Oh, great. Seriously, this is like such an OP village. Two OP villages right next to each other. I'll take your books, thank you very much. I might just like steal the stuff from one of these and then like condense the one village into two. I mean, the two villages into one. Words exist, and I'm not very good at them. What's in here? Oh, another... Smelter? Smoker? Uh, not smoker. I'm a joker. I'm a smoker. No, it's just another... Uh, um... There's two bells in this one? Jeez, so I can create my own third village. This is mildly dangerous. Did I already check this one? Yeah, I did. I literally just need like one more. Uh, the one more obsidian. I want him to die. Actually, maybe I don't want him to become a zombie villager, because then I'd have to deal with another zombie. Speaking of, I should probably go to sleep. Before, like, 50 zombies appear. Cool. There's an end. There's two endies over there. Okay, so it's looking like other than the blacksmith, this village wasn't, ow, very loot filled. But all things considered, I'm doing pretty good. Now all I really need is a swamp to be nearby. So that I can, uh, so that I can get mending. Because apparently, different biomes, villagers, especially librarians, will trade different things. I'm trying to figure out what I'm supposed to do right now. And, uh, and, uh, the only way to get a villager that trades mending is a swamp librarian. Or like some men the one that trades uh, mending uh, books. Which is what we want the most. Because that can be applied to literally anything that has durability. Oh, and there's a lava lake right there. I could like... I could just craft a bucket and I could make a nether portal like literally right now. But I don't feel like doing that literally right now. Looks like this village is on safer ground, so we're gonna build up this one. 
Oh, uh, I, I guess I was wrong about this one being safer. This one looks more stable as far as. Oh, I was about to say no. There is there. I was gonna say like there's seriously a mine shaft here too. But no, <laughs> there's part of the village underground. <laughs> Oh, jeez, that's priceless. Uh, I don't feel comfortable breaking any of the- What? Who built this? Who thought this was a good idea? Okay, um... Oh, whoops. I want to meet the civil engineer who designed this village. And ask him what the heck he was smoking and if I can have some. Just kidding, I don't smoke. Don't smoke, kids. Alright, just break my fault. Just semi-MLG right there. Oh boy. He's gonna break that down in me. Okay, well we can just kind of take that bed because it's not doing any like what is that huh. this house has no foundation huh. it's like the freaking great and spacious building and there's a villager down here huh. the villager disagrees he's like hey can i have some huh. trades and he's like i disagree okay we're taking huh. that Taking that, taking that. Um, okay, have fun out there. And take everything that's of any value from here and then just dip. Like, I might even want to, like, just push that villager off a cliff. Take some of the torches. I can't believe this village just like, part of this village just straight up appeared underground. Like this, it's just so janky. Why was he not on fire? I don't care. Uh, this is gonna be annoying because of the sand. Oh wait, I broke like the number seven rule of Minecraft. Always have a torch in your offhand. The rule that I totally didn't just make up. But Turf Master, that's just good practice. It's not really a rule. No, it's a rule. Freak you all. Unless you agree that it should be a rule or is a rule, then then don't break you. Then you're awesome. Because you think I'm right, and people who think I'm people who think I'm right are are also right and are awesome because I'm awesome. Okay, so yeah, change of plans. Okay, so this village is huge. Yeah, this village is, it's definitely more stable as far as, like, what's in it. It's, it's has, oh wait, hold on. Do neither of these have farms? Okay, no, one of them had a farm. I know one of them did. I think. I think I know that one of them had a farm. Get out of there. I really hope one of them has a farm. Otherwise, we're going to have some issues.
Okay, okay. No, never mind. This this village right here is the better one. It's got kind of this annoying cliff hillside, but that can be terraformed with relative ease. Just like chunky lifting up boulders. We're gonna want to farm right there. First thing you need to do is craft some things. We're also going to stimulate the village's population um, population increase by putting another bed there. Why did I move that? We're going to... Nah, 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 nah. Why is it almost night? That's cringe. Oh, wait a minute. I also have a, another blast furnace. No. I'll probably live in the library. I'm taking my next vacation at the library!